Less than an hour, local leaders could move forward with a plan to hike up the price for some families' water bills by as much as 25 percent. News 6's Lauren Korn is in Flagler Beach with more on the plan and what homeowners have to say about it. Nikki Sheets lives in Flagler Beach year-round and pays $100 a month for her water bill. Well, I think it's, it's more than I should be paying. It wasn't that much a couple years ago. I need need up. Ron Schultz lives here part time and pays less than $100 a month. But both say they understand why the city is proposing a 12.5% increase on water and sewer rates. These kind of changes are ultimately uh, necessary. And if I was on the council, I would feel between a rock and a hard place, but I would vote to increase it because it needs done. The city says the extra $6.91 that would be tacked onto a resident's monthly bill will support the maintenance and future projects on a decades-old wastewater treatment plant. And it'll also add money to a utilities fund. All part of a five-year capital plan that the city says benefits not only residents, but the environment. If we'd have been making an increase of, say, 10%, we would actually have $3 million in reserves. Right now, our reserves for utilities, not general fund, to be very clear, uh, you know, they're hurting. Some of the projects include adding two more wells, rehabilitating lift stations, adding a generator on the plant for backup power, and paying more attention to pipes. A lot of work has been neglected on the, on the piping, so we, we have that factored in also with this increase. To start replacing pipe, and start lining pipe. My job is as a city manager is to get all our reserves up to a standard and get the plants up to a standard and then we can actually start actually doing very minimal increases. In Flagler Beach, Lauren Cornett getting results, News 6.